Hey, what's going on guys? It's Legendary right here and welcome back to another Clash Royale video. And first off, I am going to apologize for not uploading a video yesterday. I'm trying so hard to get daily uploads, but I have work and a ton of things. And I also was working on some new channel art. I finished it. I will try and put a picture of it up uh, on the video if I remember. So here it is. And uh, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. So today we are going to be using the eight least used cards uh, in tournaments and classic challenges. So I went on to Stats Royale, checked the eight least used cards, and I have them compiled right here in a deck. As you can see, Heal, Cannon Mortar, both Spawners, Bomb Tower, Tesla, and Bats. Uh, if you play any tournaments or classic challenges at all, you'll probably know that you haven't seen many of these cards. So, uh, without further ado, let's hop straight into a classic challenge. Alright, so our opponent will be Fight in Phillies from the Clan USA. Uh, this deck is a very building heavy deck. Uh, looks like Spawner Mortar, I guess. Um, that's something I haven't tried. Uh, but anyways, let's get something going on. Uh, let's actually place down a cannon right here. We don't have anything good to deal with, like, um, to deal with, uh, air. So let's hope and pray that this guy doesn't have any air. Mortar gets a shot onto the tower. Dang. Uh, now the golem will split and let's get ourselves a goblin hut down. He just used a rocket, so he will not be able to rocket out the goblin hut. And uh, now as I save up elixir, uh, I will be able to place a barbarian hut down as well. Just constantly keeping pressure. I used to play spawners with an expo deck, so I kind of know how to play spawners. So anyways, we're going to put down a barbarian hut right here. Um, see how he manages to take care of this. Let's put a Tesla up here as well. Uh, I really don't know what to do. Um, let's see here. Alright, Tesla will go and work on the Night Witch. Takes out the Night Witch. And let's get a mortar going right there. Uh, but unfortunately that was some bad timing. And unfortunately the mortar will not be able to get anything done. Um, he does have a splash heavy deck. So fortunately our bomb tower will be able to do lots of work. Let's just plop it down right here. Hopefully it can splash everything out. And look at that bomb tower is doing work. He's gonna rock it again. Looks like he's going to resort to rocket cycling me down. Uh, so now that I know he has a quite spammy deck, uh, I am going to get the bomb tower ready before I place down my mortar. So anyways, here he's going to counter the last wave of barbs. I'm going to immediately replace the barb hut. Uh, he's probably going to place a... I don't know what he's going to do. I think he's saving up elixir for a golem, but uh, my troops are just completely going to shrek his tower. Uh, yep, Golem goes down, but that's quite late, and um, we've done quite a bit of damage to his tower. So anyways, let's get some bats down, followed up by a bomb tower. Now this bomb tower should be able to do tons of work. Um, let's see here, bomb tower, doing work, taking everything out, guys. And then we can get a mortar down, follow it up with a cannon, and all this splash and stuff. Hopefully, oh my god, the mortar actually locks onto the tower, takes it out. We're just spamming down the building. Let's plop a heal right here, just because why not? And we have won a battle using the eight least popular tournament cards. So good game, and look at that. Uh, this deck was really crazy, and I guess it does have a bit of synergy. But anyways, that is all I have time for today. If you enjoyed the episode, please leave a like, as well as a subscription to my channel. And as always, this is Logan Ray, and I'm signing off. What are you waiting for? Subscribe to my channel. Sub sub subscribe to my channel and leave a like. Subscribe to my channel. Sub sub subscribe to my channel.